gotta tell the people where we're going, what we're doing. So right now, we're in Total Paul. Well, ah! Lucelli! <laughs> We're not in Tonopah yet. <laughs> okay, we're on our way to Tonopah. It's creepy! We're gonna stay at the Climb Motel, right? What we're gonna do is we're gonna explore. We're gonna go to um, the Tonopah Cemetery. I'm there gonna we take my horse to the road. Yeah, so <laughs> right now we're going through a little run downtown. Okay. Which one's more haunted, the mitzvah? Or the clown hotel. I think the clown because I had the cemetery right next to it. No, I think Miss Ma. That's where I'm about to stay because this is luxury ghost hunting. <laughs> They're not poor ghosts. It's a classic ghost. It's on the left, right? Panic no, notes on the left. It's on the right. Back. On the left. Right. No, it's on the left. If left. Not. It's if right there, left. Yeah, we didn't shake on it. Yo, y'all saw that. We didn't shake on it. The clown motel. Here. Oh, they did remodel it. No, they fucking did it. Oh but the nasty cut. Nope. At least we're not the only crazy ones. I don't want to be here. <laughs> Bro, we're going to the cemetery. This is next. the cemetery right over there. Right, we gotta be chill before they don't even let us stay. You're the one that's screaming. Oh, God. Cemetery. We are here. We are here. I'm scared. Warning This property is protected by killer clowns. Excuse me. Some graves are open ahead. Oh, shoot. I got the wrong one. Y'all ready? No. I'm scared. You wanted to do I want to go to the Miss You Fun's wanted thing. to do this. I can't still play it. You know the Miss Fun's haunted too, right? Yeah, yeah, but it's like it doesn't look nicer. that scary. How about we just go to the cemetery and then we go check in the Miss Fun? I have my inhaler. <laughs> I need a mouth so I can expand my lungs in case I need to scream. You better not. That mm. you, this is good stuff. You want some? Mom! <laughs> what oh. is it? His name's Fish. He's on my chamomile. To, uh, <laughs> to ease my nerves. Let's go. I gotta poop. Nasty, bro. <laughs> we gotta just said where we're gonna stay at the Miss Spell. Here. This is no decision. Bro, you it's can't even talk. You're the one who cry all the time. I wanna stay. Talking about canceling. I'm staying at the Miss Spell. Y'all can stay right here. Uh -uh, I'm oh, at bro. The, the classy ghost. Yeah. So we're here for the cemetery and for the clowns, and we're trying to see that hand move. We might catch something. Maybe one of them is a wink. One of those little dolls is gonna jump on you. Wink. Did you fart? Yeah. She's trying to. You're nasty. There's no turning back now. That's the clown, bro. Yeah, it's not. Do not do that. No, I don't want to find it. No. no. <laughs> yes. 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 No. yes. Yes. Normally, it's not available. You have to book in two months, mm -hmm. but somebody just cancelled. It's meant to be. It's meant to be. Yes, it is. Some people don't experience nothing, but some people experience it. so many stuff. Maybe. That stuff move. They see the orbs shooting in the room. I mean, if you. Encounter them, they are good. They're not very good. So what do you want to do? The haunted. The haunted one? Yes. Oh my god. Okay. Come you want to see the room? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Most haunted room at the clown hotel. So you just. Uh, it's a lucky day for this haunted room. Oh my oh, god. What the fuck? <laughs> right? Bro. Bro. I said, you're gonna sleep here, you're gonna sleep here. <laughs> oh, they cancel too? Yeah. Oh. There were six people there, still make up. This is a non haunted or what? <laughs> no, Can you make it? Oh my no, god. No. Oh my god. <laughs> uh uh. Oh my god. Bro. So it rules good, right? Yeah. No, this one gives me a creature. Oh my god. We have neighbors? I'm here. Oh, I'm don't, room, don't be scaring us at night. Don't no, be no, scaring no. us. <laughs> In my room, two people died. <gasps> what? Oh my god. Have you heard anything? Do you hear anything? I see all the time people are walking. Working, walking. And I, in like the beginning, I was people? just going up there and checking the room. Nobody's there. All the way, five rooms. And then I'm hearing all the way that they are <laughs> talking, laughing, walking. Not in my room, I don't know, somehow. I had no experience in my room. Oh, we're really going to do this. 
Now, if we go to the graveyard, will we get kicked out? Over you there? can walk 24 7. The best time is 2 to 3. <laughs> they have party time. They, got, oh. <laughs> they ask you to join us. <laughs> I don't think I can get no sleep in this this far. I'm not getting any sleep. Do you regret it? Yes. Yeah, why did you want why did you persuade me to get that haunted one? So for real, this is how we're gonna prepare at night yeah. when we sleep. We're gonna latch this door up to that railing right there. Cause I'm not trying to wake up to no damn slamming doors. We're gonna unplug this phone because I don't want it to ring in the middle of the night. And we're leaving that chair no, there no, all I night. I'm not trying to see that thing shake either. Y'all ready? We're about to go to the mitzvah. We hear that's haunted too. We'll go check it out. See the lady in the red dress. So we be quiet. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> all right, so we're going to the mitzvah, like Miss Sally said. And then after that, we're going to chill in this room, get all warmed up, and then we're going to the cemetery. <laughs> Quit. They saw you go down. Bro, we do not need this right now. A black cat. Yeah, yeah. Two! Oh, two black cats. So we're here at the Mystical Hotel and we're about to go look around the hotel. We heard there's a lady in the red dress. We're gonna try to see if we can find her tonight. This is like a little bullshit. This used to be a bank. Right, yeah. Try to rob it. And supposedly they got locked in and they died in here. So let's go back up here. Okay, so right now we're um, gonna go look around. Let's go upstairs. Checked it out. I was trying to see if it was haunted. We walked around, but didn't see nothing. Let's not go to the grave. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Okay. All right. So we got the night vision going. We're actually in the cemetery right now. I, I don't want to go over here on this side because this over here, that's where I heard the noise earlier. Okay, let's go. I swear I'm freaking out. We're about to try to get this recorder going. See if we can catch anything. I hope we don't. We gotta be careful because we're not trying to step on anybody's grave. Stay right there, stay right there. What? Stay right there. What? Anybody that wants to talk to us? It's picking up something. We don't want to hurt you guys. We just want to... We don't want to mean to bother you guys. Talk to you. We just want to know if anything is out here with us. Just to show us. Let us know. Anything? Nothing. Oh, we're so far from the car right now. If there's anybody that wants to talk to us, go ahead and do so now. So we know that you're here. What is it picking up? I don't know. It's going crazy right now. Yeah. What does that mean? Oh, it's going faster. It's over here. Are you guys trying to tell us something? Right here. There it goes. There it goes again. Oh, oh my fuck. god. Oh fuck. It's this one. It's this one, Walter. We're not here to hurt you, Walter. We don't want Brush. to bother you. <laughs> Bro, it really just Walter. did that. It hasn't been not it has not been doing that. That was the first time it since talked got back. Here. It talked back to and us. And it said Lauren. Oh my god. Let's go back. No, we have to keep going. Go ahead, speak. We're not here to bother you. No. We just want to talk. No. Okay. Come on. 
Lauren? Who's Lauren? We don't know. The machine it's says Lauren. Religion? Look, look what we're by. Put your, put your light. Oh, Walter again. Is that you, Walter, trying to talk to us? Every time we come walk by his grave, it starts beeping like crazy. It's only this one. Oh, the way. no. The way. Way. Oh, it's going crazy again? Yeah. Look. Look at that. Oh, oh my god. <gasps> field draft? Y'all heard Bro, that. Bro, no, no, no. What the wind, that? the wind. It said field draft. Uh-uh. We're going. We're going. I don't even want to look back. How do we get out? Quit. Right here. Right here. Right here. Let me go first. Okay. It keeps beeping. It's beeping like crazy. It wasn't doing this when we first got here. Yo, it's time to go now, for sure. It just said water. Oh, it just said water, bro. bro. Just said water. The machine keeps going off and we're leaving the cemetery. Uh, that's it, it for just tonight, said guys. Raw. It's going crazy. Right. These are the words that came up. It said Lauren, then it said religion, and then it said field dry. Before it said that, there was wind and it sounded like somebody was whistling or howling. Bro. That's what it did. It said headstone. It just said headstone. <laughs> when we went to this one specific grave uh, over Walter, oh, Walter yeah, it was, it's like it spoke it the meter. Me. That's when it actually started reading. Ah, those black oh, cats! Bro, quit. You Where? scared. Right there. Oh, yeah. That's, <laughs> that's when this app actually like started working and something talked like back to us. Alright, I'll show you what it said. So first it said Lauren, then it said religion, then it said field draft, then it said water, then it said wall, then it just said waste, and then it said growling, and it said case, now it said headstone. And my phone just died. Dude, my phone did really die. And it was at 14%. That's crazy. For sure, bro. there's something in there. Let's go to our room, bro, because it's heck Let's go back to the here. room. So we got the cemetery down there. We got the main lobby right here, and this is our room, one of the most haunted rooms here at the Clown Motel. So we're not sleeping tonight. So me and Noemi are sleeping tonight. So we just got back from the cemetery, and this little chicken stayed in the car. That was freezing. Let's take a picture of our hotel door. I didn't know that. She got out the car. She took a couple more pictures, and uh, look what she got. Okay, so. While you guys were in the cemetery, I wanted to take pictures because I was like getting myself all worked up and I was like, dude, I'm going to take pictures of our window and if I see a fucking shadow, I'm going to fucking lose my shit and, you know, I was just hoping I would catch something and then I noticed I did. You see this right here? I thought it was no and then I thought it was those dots that are in the building, but look how it starts like moving yeah it moved Bro, it it's... was right there and it moved down uh -uh. okay and then look at this <gasps> Bro, oh my god and look how close it's getting to the car now like why is it no it looks what? like a phase yeah Bro, that's like what it's... i thought too what is that look it's it's moving. It's, it's just like seriously it's be, no, it's like closer. seriously behind the car. I took another one because I was like, what the fuck? It's bro. Gone. Wait. It's gone. Completely gone. There's bro, no way we can debug wild. that. What the hell was that? I don't know, but it's creepy. This is where it starts Ooh, off. It ends up behind the light of the car with the windows down or up when you took the windows were up i took another picture with the window down for sure that's not it's not even the windows, on the window it can't be the window it, it moved it literally moved bro i can't believe you actually caught something that's crazy what makes it creepy is that why was it in front of our room it looks like a face I'm telling you, it looks like a face. There's an eye, okay. and then like the hair's coming the other side. Yeah, like yeah, like that. Like a girl. It almost looks like. So you see, okay, you see right there, like that 
black part right oh, there. Do you see it? The main part is the face looking that way? Yeah. Yeah, the white part is like the hair. face. And then the hair that's coming inside of the face. And like that little line at the bottom, that's the mouth right there. I don't want to stay in here. The night is only beginning. Oh, it just leaked. If I stain the sheets, they better not charge us extra. Nasty rough. <laughs> so we've been in the room for like three hours now. Nothing's happened, but we're all dreading going back in. We don't want to sleep in there. The mood has changed. I don't know if it's because it's getting closer to midnight and it's getting late and it's like not fun anymore it's like just like the anticipation of something scary or bad happening is just like we're all at a edge it just got real like it just kicked in like we actually have to sleep in there i have to pee <laughs> <laughs> i'm like stress eating it's not even funny oh, yes. Like we just drove around the little town here and the whole town is just eerie, like it's just a vibe. Should we go down to the grave again? I'll take that as a no. <laughs> yes, let's go, let's go, let's go. I want to oh. go back in the grave because I think something's gonna happen and I want my mom to go because last time she didn't go. No, I'm too scared. I feel like this time it's gonna be different. Let's go! Come on! Mm -hmm. I'm scared. I wanna go home. We came to the clown hotel. We went to the cemetery. Like, that, that's good enough. I'm not trying to go to the cemetery like, twice. Even, what if we start screaming when we need something and nobody's there to help us? Like, there's not no more human beings. Except the ones that are sleeping, but what if they don't hear shit? Why well, would we be screaming? What if we see something scary? Then we just run. That's all we gotta do. No, I've seen the movies. We run, we trip over the rock, and they come after us mm -hmm. and catch us. The white girl always survives, and there's no white girls here. Lucille is white. I'm brown, Mom. I'm going to be the first one to die. And I want to go. Let's go. All right, let's go. To the cemetery? Yeah. Let's go home. Let's go to the cemetery. Let's you go. You want to go to the cemetery? Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, bro, I thought I heard something. I guess I'm, going, I'm going last, like, behind you guys. I'll go first. I got to get everything. So you go first, oh. so you get a glimpse of everything. No, I want to see if there's anything you get like, no, close quick to us. No, no, you get quick. the first row audience, that's what you are. Yeah, it's like a different vibe from literally inside of the car and being in front of the Bro, cemetery. 10 minutes tops. No, I don't want to. If you want to, you go. I honestly don't want to. Like, I feel like we can't get what we ask for if we keep like yeah. being disrespectful. We want something to happen, we want something to happen, and then when it happens, we're going to get freaked out, we're not going to want to be here, and we're going to want to leave. Okay, so we didn't go to the grave, so now we're going to um, do night vision in the room. Night no. vision on. Uh, just gonna turn off the lights. Bro. Lights off. Lucille, stop. No, don't do it. Oh my god. Are you gonna do an app? Yes. Is it the app? I have to stop by her. I'm scared on her. You move around. Crowd. No, there's too many people in here. Get up, mom, move down. So it's, it that just that said crowd. No, no. If you're gonna do the night vision, don't. It's around 10 o'clock. Everybody's sleeping, and you're sleeping, and everybody lets you sleep, and now you're ready to get up, and now you're gonna start filming and waking everybody up because you're up. There are two footsteps upstairs. So I was laying in bed. I was up for like at least an hour. All of a sudden I hear this loud thump coming from where our headrest is. And of course I got startled so I sat up. And as soon as I sat up I just heard two footsteps. And you're like okay two footsteps. No big deal. Maybe somebody's upstairs right? I said I'm gonna find out right now. We went to bed. There was, there was nobody upstairs. All the rooms upstairs above us were vacant. It's empty. The windows are open. Are you serious? Empty. Empty. 
And this is a room right above us. It's all empty up here. It just brings me back to the story of the front desk guy. I see all the time people are walking. Working, walking. Then he goes and checks and it's empty. And I notice these footprints over here. They were all over there. If that's the case, look at these footprints. And I'm walking right now. I don't leave one trace. Nothing. And we've been walking back and forth in this room. So based on all the experiences we've been telling each other and all the stories we've been telling each other and all the footprints and the footsteps we heard and the photo evidence, would you say it's haunted? Uh, no. Yeah, I do. I feel like you have, like, you have to have a certain energy to experience something. At the beginning, I didn't think I was going to experience anything. But there are like little things here and there. So, yeah. Baba? No, it's not haunted. It's not haunted? How to explain your pictures? They're just stupid. It's probably a smudge in your window. How do you explain the footprints right there that I try to leave? That's stupid. What about the footsteps you heard upstairs? No, but you said that was you. Are you just trying to cover up the fact that you're scared that it actually happened? I'm scared. You're fucking scared to go to the restroom. Yeah. Scared to fucking videotape in the nighttime. You're asking me. I think it's what you just work yourself up. Smudge in the window though, really? Yeah. After you put the window down, and it, we clearly saw it move in every picture you took. All right, well, two out of three say it's haunted. If you don't believe us, check it out for yourself. I had to sleep next to that. Thanks, bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.